Hello battery lovers! This time I've tested the 21700 battery made for Tesla by Samsung. Its model number is INR21700 33J. This battery is neither a high capacity nor a high drain cell. Its advantage is in its cycle life, which is up to 4 times longer than that of a good quality lithium ion cell and is close to lithium ferrophosphate ones. Cycle life is critical for electric vehicles, but not only for them. There are lots of applications where high discharge current or high capacity don't take the priority. Before passing to this battery specs and test results, let me remind you my testing rules and conditions. All the tests were done using a special battery tester, the ZKE Tech EBC820, which supports 4 wire measurement, discharge current up to 20 amps, and it can be connected to a PC for building graphs. I've upgraded my battery holder to the version 3.0. I have made contact pads from 0.5mm pure copper sheet. The positive terminal is 9mm wide and the width of negative terminal is 11.5mm. The pads are designed to provide good connection even with batteries which have deep placed positive or negative contacts. I've followed all the prescriptions of the IEC 61960 standard concerning battery's capacity measurement. The surrounding air temperature was 20-25 centigrees and before each discharging cycle the battery was charged at its standard charging current which is mentioned in its datasheet and after that it was left for one hour minimum as the standard requires. After this charging cycle the battery was again left for one hour minimum. I buy my batteries from Queen Battery, which is my reliable supplier of genuine batteries. They offer individual approach to each customer and special discounts depending on the quantity you buy. You can find a link to their website and their sales manager's email in the description under this video. The cell which I've tested has the following marking. INR21733J Samsung SDI 2H 64. It has the following specs according to its datasheet. Typical capacity 30 to 70 mAh. Typical energy 20 Watt hours. Minimum energy 11.4 Watt hours. Standard charge current 1.6 amps. Maximum charge current 3.2 amps. Charge cutoff current 64 mA. Charge end voltage 4.2 volts. Recommended charge end voltage 4.1 volt. Maximum continuous discharge current 6.4 amps. Discharge cutoff voltage 3 volts. AC impedance 29 milliohms. Average weight 62 grams. The manufacturer recommends charging this battery only up to 4.1 volt. In this case, the cycle life of the battery gonna be more than 2000 cycles while keeping more than 75% of its capacity. Don't forget that this cell is designed for Tesla. The measured weight of my cell was 62.81 grams. The measured DC internal resistance was about 34 milliohms. At 0.2C or 0.64 amps, Samsung 33J gave out 34.42 milliamp hours or 12.68 watt hours. At 2 amp discharge, the result was 32.66 milliamp hours or 11.81 watt hours. At 5 amp discharge, it gave out 3200 milliamp hours or 11.09 watt hours. At 6.4 amps, 31.76 milliamp hours or 10.81 watt hours. At the end of the day, 33J's capacity was noticeably higher than declared, but there was nothing impressive. The only impressive thing in this battery is its cycle life, which I don't have the chance to test. That's all for today. Feel free to like this video, leave your thoughts in comments, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Bye bye.